Okay, so today I have Aardvark Book Club. And like Book of the Month, I only picked up uh, one book this month because, well, I couldn't afford the other two this month, but maybe next month I'll be able to. So, I really should have brought my knife. That would have been a lot easier than these scissors. Possibly. There it goes. Sort of. There we go. And then, this one says, think inside the box. And we got a really neat bookmark this time. Oh, it's plastic. And it says, Aardvark. Aardvark Book Club Two Year Fresh Ears. So that's nice, nice, neat little plastic uh, bookmark instead of the paper ones that we always get. Move that over there for a minute. And then they got their little card and it says it's their second birthday. And it says celebrate with us for by voting for the Second ever member's choice book, like five lucky participants will win a free a free cat a cat cast your vote and then it gives the website and everything else like that. Then it shows the book clubs or bookshelves. So and it shows you that you can download this on the Apple Store and the Google Play. And it says think inside the box. The book that I picked up is USA Today, USA Today best-selling author of My Roommate is a Vampire, Jenna Levian, Levian, Levine, could have pronounced that wrong, My Vampire Plus One, It's Love at First Bite, so yeah, this is one, it says, some of the praises on the back says, a funny, sexy romp that will Bust you out of any slump, reading or otherwise. New York Times best-selling author, Hannah Witten. And it says, Jenna writes perfectly, Jenna writes perfectly escapist, paranormal delights. New York Times best-selling author, Sarah Adams. So, it says, Nothing sucks more than a fake dating, more than fake dating a vampire in this paranormal romantic comedy. Okay, that's why I picked this one up besides the fact that it's uh, also signed. And then over here is about the author. And then let's read what more it says. Uh, Amelia Collins is defined by success. She would even go as far to say uh, as to say successfully single, but not according to her family. She's tired of uh, of the constant questions about her non-existing dating life. When an invitation to yet another family wedding arrives, she decides to get everyone off her back once and for all by finding someone, anyone to put poses her date. After a chance, in, chance encounter with Reginald Cle Clevis, I guess, Amelia decides he's the perfect for her proposal. He's a bit strange, but that's fine. Or for her purpose. He's a bit strange, but that's fine. It'll discourage, discourage tough questions from her family. And it certainly doesn't hurt that he's very handsome. For century old, centuries old vampire Reginald posing as a as her plus one sounds like a uh, sounds like the ultimate fun. If it helps his uh, if it helps his ruse of pretending to be human so much better. Oh, and it helps his uh, ruse of being human, pretending to be human so much better. As Amelia and Reginald practice their uh, fox their fake romance, it becomes clear that uh. 
Reginald is as loyal to her as the day is long and that and Mary was first impressed and couldn't have been more uh, wrong. Suddenly being in a re real relationship with uh, Reggie sounds pretty fa fantastic. So this will be uh, an interesting read. And I will catch... But yes, yeah, so that was this month's Aardvark Book of the Month and maybe next month I'll be able to, uh, to afford to get the three that I usually do. And I'll catch y'all next time with the next video I do.